the hierarchy of the WWE has changed as of last night. Hey guys, this is the AWO here, Aaron Ward, presenting you Wrestling Channel Laying a Smackdown. If you're into wrestling, make sure to like, smash that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new here, subscribe. The subscribe button down below, or at the end when it pops up, click subscribe there, and make sure to share this out all over social media or wherever. Tell your friends, family, colleagues, everybody, especially if you're wrestling. This is a place for you for wrestling content. Okay, I do prediction shows, I do watch alongs once in a while, I do topics, I talk about opinion stuff. I will do, I do, I have. I also do debates or discussions, top ten stuff. We'll talk about in the future. We'll talk. We'll do like top ten theme musics, stuff like that. And we'll and I'll guess I'll talk about discussions. And we'll be looking back at some previous stuff. And also do be watch alongs for matches and matches in the past. I'm thinking of doing one for The Rock and John Cena at the first WrestleMania 28 back in 2012. I don't know when that date's gonna be. It's gonna be a live stream. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. Tell everybody and join me for that. So, yes, the hierarchy of WWE has changed, guys. You want, <laughs> as of last night on NXT, you wanna know why? It's because it's because the great one. The Rock, Dwayne Johnson's daughter, Simone Johnson, who goes by the name of Ava Rain in NXT, officially debuts in WWE. Now the and she has red hair, and she debuts with Joe Gacy's group, The Schism. They wear masks and stuff. And this is a week after. Black Adam premieres, where Rock has been, you know, Dwayne Johnson has been telling, oh, the hierarchy of the DC universe is about to change. No, he, he's kind of right with the James Gunn, Peter Saffron news. But that's, a, that's pop culture. But it's also, uh, maybe he was hinting about that his daughter, that his daughter's debuting. Debuting. And now, everybody in WWE has to watch out. The Great One's daughter is. Eh, has made her debut on TV. And now, we'll see where that goes. This is they're going to bring her up slowly. They're not going to rush her. They they kind of rushed Dwayne Johnson when he debuted. They tried to make him as, try to push him down our throats. And the fans rejected it. Rejected that push. They turned him heel. Joined the nation. Best thing that ever happened to him. And his career took off from there. They're not going to make that same mistake with his daughter, obviously. Slowly bring her. And then when she becomes big enough. And you know, here's the thing, guys. I know I'm joking about hierarchy because it's the Rock's daughter. She doesn't. She wants to create a niche for herself. She doesn't want to go in knowing that she's the Rock. She doesn't want to be. She is a Rock's daughter in real life. But she doesn't want to make a character revolve re, re, around her father. Not like Charlotte Flair. Like Charlotte Flair, her character... Well, she has her own character, but a lot of it has to do with being a daughter of Wick. She doesn't. She'll always be the Rock's daughter. And people are always going to say, chant Rocky, Rocky. But she, she wants her character for herself. Right? And I think that's good. <laughs> and I was just joking about a hierarchy. But you know what? I'm eager to see what she is. She's been in developmental for years. She, I think she was 18 or 19 when she signed with them. And she's very young. So I guess she's ready for TV time, obviously. That's why they put her on TV. Yesterday. And we'll see go from doing an NXT is a smart thing to do. Having her in a faction, I think it was the right move for her to do. Right move for them to do with her. And we'll see where her career goes from here. There's no pressure on her. I know people are gonna say, "Oh, she's a rock star." There's gonna be a lot of pressure. There's not putting pressure on her. Let her, let her, let her career dictate for herself. Let her have her own career. There's not putting any pressure on her because she's a rock star. Okay. 
No pressure on her. Okay, just put no pressure on her. But yeah, that's all I want to say, guys. The hierarchy of the WWE has changed. The Rock's family, actual blood, blood, generation. Not, not his cousins, not the bloodline, but his generation, his daughter. It's in. It's changed the game. <laughs> guys, that's it. Rock stars in it. In WWE, make sure they be in WWE on TV. Tell me what you guys think. Comment, like, subscribe, share it. You know all the drill. And yeah, take care, guys.